but it is at all. This evening I will do a walking video to the Drill Hall Beach and the Hilton Hotel. So right now I'm by the garrison. I'm in here stage Christ Church, about to go over to the garrison. That's okay, this part that I am on. This part of Christ Church I'm on is on the border of the parish of St. Michael. I'm very close to the parish of St. Michael, so basically I'm in St. Michael right now, but the garrison historic area and UNESCO or heritage site. This is just on the outskirts of Bridgestone, but it's a part of the Bridgestone project. Yeah, there's a lot back at here stays in the world, but you will find the Argentinian and Venezuelan embassy. And this is the Savannah Hotel here. This is the Savannah Hotel. That's because I know about the garrison, historic area. This is the Garrison Historic Area and UNESCO World Heritage Site in Bridgetown, Barbados. But this is the Brigade House, which was the old Cali's Pharmacy years ago. Yeah, yeah. That's guys. The right turn will lead back to the paddocks at the garrison. And back to the Arcade Road and the Seven Day Adventure Secondary School, Primary School, and Valley Morocco and Colonna Road. Yes, we just look back at Hastings Road. We will find the Savannah Hotel, and this was the old Hastings Police Station before it moved further up the road. So, this building is now vacant. Yes, guys, this is the garrison area, and this is the rear strap here. Where the horses race, when they have horse, where, where the horses race, then they race without the garrison. Um, boxing Day, the first of January, Easter Monday, and other and and go on Sandy Leon Gold Cup, which is the first Saturday in March. This is the race track here where the horses race. You can also see the flag of Barbados here as well, and you can see the 50th anniversary monument in the center of the race track. Here at the garrison. Well, the garrison area. And this is nowhere in North Portion, St. Anne's Fort and Barracks. And this is the Barbados Defense Force right here. And you can see the clock tower for the garrison as well. Which is best referred to as the main guy. Yes, there's a garrison. There's a military area. Okay, the garrison is a military area. Again, we're looking at the St. Anne's Fort and Barracks and the Barbados Defense Force. And we are now approaching the Drill Hall Beach. The Drill Hall Beach is mostly used by soldiers because it is just behind the St. Anne's Fort and Barracks. It's mostly used by soldiers, and this is the rear end of the Savannah Hotel here. This is the garrison. Is a part of the UNESCO World Heritage Site in Barbados. One of the UNESCO World Heritage Sites in Barbados. And this is all the rear end of the Savannah Hotel. That's good. Now we're going down to the Drill Hall Beach. Which is just behind the St. Anne's Fort and Barracks. And you can see some of the old vehicles that were once used by the Barbados Defense Force, which are no longer in use. And this is all the Savannah Hotel. Right. Oh, 
once again the garrison was a military area back in the 17th and 18th and 19th century so that's where there are lots of cannons and so on down by the garrison and that is the place where Barbados held its first independent ceremony the first independent ceremony when it received independence from England in on the 30th of November 1966 on the night of the 30th of November 1966 when it first received independence it was held at the garrison Savannah under the leadership of Barbados' first Prime Minister the right honourable Errol Walton Barrow who is also a national hero of Barbados yes, this is the Drill Hall Beach And this is the rear end of the Savannah Hotel. This is all the Savannah Hotel in Barbados. And this is now the Drill Hall Beach, which is on the southwest coast of Barbados. And it's also a part of the Carla Bay area. Hall Beach, which is mostly used by soldiers, and it's also a good surfing spot as well. Lots of people do surfing here. That's the Drill Hall Beach, which is just behind the Garrison Historic Area and UNESCO World Heritage Site in Bershon, Barbados. This is the Drill Hall Beach, the Savannah Hotel, and all the back of the St. Anne's Fort and Barracks. Yes, please. This is also a perfect spot for surfing, and it's also a part of the Kyler Bay area. Yes, please. The Drill Hall Beach is mostly used by soldiers, it's where they hold their cookouts and The bonfires and so on. Yes, guys. The first time I came here was in 2001 with the Boy Scouts. The Barbados Scout when I was in Scouts. That was when I was a kid. I came here for a, um, a cookout. And then the next time I came here was with a camp. The same year. That was in the summertime, 2001. It was a bonfire night and the person that organized that group, that camp, was also a member of a former group. Okay, this beach is mo mostly used by former groups such as the Girl Guides, the Boy Scouts, the Barbados Cadet Corps, the Barbados Defense Force and The Barbados Loop Service. That's good. This is all the Drill Hall Beach. It's on the southwest coast of Barbados and it's also a part of the Kyla Bay area. I have a walk along the shores now. And this is all the Drill Hall Beach, a perfect surfing spot. Headed towards the Hilton Hotel. Yes, please. This is the Barbet. This is the Drill Hall Beach on the southwest coast of Barbados, and it's also a part of the Carlo Bay area. the hotel in the, back, in the background That's 
all the drill hall beach on the southwest coast of Barbados and it's also a part of the Carlisle Bay area and also a perfect surfing spot to do surfing and so on Beach, which is situated on the southwest coast of Barbados and it's also in the Carlo Bay area. You can see the Hilton Hotel in the distance, which I will be heading to shortly. That's great. All the drill hall beach. West Coast of Barbados and it's also in the Charlotte Bay area. And it's just behind the St. Anne's Fort and Barracks and the part of the Garrison UNESCO World Heritage Site in Bristol and Barbados. And now I'm now approaching the Hilton Hotel in Barbados. One of Barbados' first class hotels. It was the original Hilton Hotel was destroyed in 1999 and it was rebuilt in a modern structure. That's this the hall beach again. Popular surfing spot here in beautiful Barbados. Not very frequented, but it's not it's not often frequented by Barbados unless they are surfing or, or unless they are a member of some military group or something like that. Most people go to Pebbles Beach or Browns Beach, which is nearby. Browns Beach and Pebbles Beach are also on the southwest coast of Barbados in the Carlo Bay area. Those the beaches are part of the Carlo Bay area, but the Dread Hall Beach with Graham on is mostly used by soldiers or military groups or persons going to do surfing. Yes, this Dread Hall Beach and beautiful Barbados. This is the Hilton Hotel here in Barbados. One of Barbados' first class, top class hotels. And it's also where you will find a Needham's Point Lighthouse. Point is the name Needham's Point Beach. Barbados has four lighthouses. There's, there's, there's Needham's Point, which is right here next to the Hilton Hotel. 
the South Point in Christchurch. This is just beyond Miami Beach. And there's Ragged Point, best in front of East Point in St. Philip, which is on the eastern end of the island. And there's North Point, which is in St. Lucie. St. Lucie is Barbados, this is Northernmost Parish. So there's four lake houses in Barbados. Again, it's the Hall Beach. to the Hilton Hotel in Barbados. Hotel, and this is in Novi and Spot Beach. Spot Beach is the north of the Johar Beach, and it's right next door to the Nevis Park Hotel, but it's also a part of the Johar Beach. This is the lifeguard hut from Needham Point Beach here in beautiful Barbados on our southwest coast. This is Hilton Hotel here. Hotel in Barbados, and this is Needham Point Beach. This is right next door to the Drill Hall Beach. That's guys, Needham Point Beach. We're on the southwest coast of Barbados, within the Cala Bay area. I will show you guys our Hilton Hotel and. Our light, our light house. Here's some beach volleyball here. This is Hilton Hotel here in Barbados. Our Hilton Hotel and the Needham Point Lake House right outside of the hotel. Here's the beach volleyball here. That's okay, the Hilton Hotel. Yeah, for the Hilton Hotel is locked, so we'll not be able to go in. But this is our Hilton Hotel here in Barbados. Yes, guys, this is our Hilton Hotel in Barbados. Here's the Hilton Hotel. 
which is in British, which is in this is just outside of the nearest point lighthouse and Joel Hall Beach. This is a a bar here, a restaurant. Hotel here in Barbados. And this is the hot. This is the swimming pool here, which is best referred as a hot tub. The hot tub or the swimming pool, which is temporarily closed. Yes, guys. This is the Hilton Hotel here in Barbados. Around here, a bar. That's good. These are here to put down here. All in Needles Point Beach. Heading towards Pebbles Beach and Bronx Beach. Yes, please. Needles Point Beach. Which is just outside of Hilton Hotel, the southwest coast of Barbados. Thanks for watching and have a blessed evening.